Good morning, everyone. This is Wolvesbane, and you're watching the 12 subscriber special. All right. Welcome to the lounge of Elimination by Challenge. At least that's what I'm calling it. I'm basing the map off of Team Escape. If you haven't seen that map, go check out my YouTube channel. I did play it with some friends. It is a really fun map. And I don't think mine's anywhere near that yet. I'm planning on probably expanding on this, although I have other projects that I'm more interested in than this. So, uh, I'm working on a PvP map with some friends. And that one's going to probably be my like 100 subscriber special. And it is turning out just amazing. So, let's see here. Basically, you have to have four players to play this map. It's pretty quick. It's like a 10-minute game. So if you guys have like 10 minutes to spare and you guys are just like, oh, I want to want to play a challenge map with some friends, this is probably a really good map to do that. Um, I want to give out, I want to say thanks to all my subscribers so far. Uh, right now I have 13 subscribers, even though this is my 12 subscriber special. So to that extra subscriber, thank you for bringing it one further than what was planned and if you make a video of this guys send me a link and I will post it in the description on the forums as well as on my YouTube page uh, basically the mechanics of this work is a player will be eliminated per room and you'll see how that works here in a minute so let's go take a look around real quick Alright, so this is the, I call this room, what is this? Oh, this is the riddle room. So basically there's four riddles to each spot, and players will stand on a spot, which will signify that they're standing here. And one of them, when all four pressure plates are activated, one player will be eliminated. It will seal them off in there. So that'll be pretty interesting, figure out who's right and who's wrong. All right. The next one is a little parkour room. You go across until you reach the end, and once you do, then two players will stand on these pressure plates. The pressure plates will seal off so that you can't really, so the third player won't be able to get in there. So that'll eliminate another player. And then in the last room with the last two players there'll be this room. So if a player falls down, it'll activate some redstone and open up a button in here for the winner to click. So you don't want to stand on the pressure plates, but you're kind of fighting each other, so it's a little hard not to. But sometimes you can use them to your advantage to make another player fall down. Because uh, some, some of these pressure pads don't fall down, but while others do. It's, it's pretty interesting. I think you'll have a lot of fun playing it. So... Let me know what you guys think, report any bugs or glitches that you find, and I hope to see you all next time.